Hey yo, welcome back everybody to another Terraria video. Today, we are testing out which mounts in Terraria are the fastest. And we are including not only vanilla mounts, but we're also including Thorium, Calamity, the Juice mod, Elemental Unleash, Louis AFK, and Elements Awoken. So let's get right to it. So let me lay down a couple of rules here before we start. Number one rule is we're only gonna be going from left to right, horizontal speed only. No vertical speed, no diagonal speed, only left or right how fast can a mount go from left to right if a mount's a flying mount and it has trouble just walking oh well that's too bad another rule is we're not using anything to help buff a mount meaning that for example the shrimpy truffle goes faster in water we're not doing that or the minecarts go faster with booster tracks we're not doing that so let's go ahead we're gonna put the wooden minecart to the test this is the minecart that you spawn with you don't even need to build it or anything let's put it to the test see how many miles per hour it can get i'm gonna assume it's gonna hit like the 50s that feels like a good number. Yeah, there you go. 51. Easy. 51. That's pretty fast for the default minecart. But we're going to put on the iron one now, the one that you have to craft with, out of iron. And we're going to see how fast this one goes. If that one went 50, maybe this one will hit the 70s. I don't know possibly 66 okay it's a lot faster it feels definitely way faster moving on to one of the fastest minecarts in the game currently and that is the mechanical minecart reaching speeds of 102 miles per hour now that isn't the last minecart that we're going to be testing out there is actually a minecart from thorium but obviously we'll test that out when we get to the thorium section so far the mechanical minecart is the fastest going at 102 miles per hour and uh you know that's pretty good not bad at all so i have the next couple of mounts organized in the way that they are obtainable on the wiki apparently this is how the wiki had them listed so obviously start with a slime mount this one gonna go pretty slow horizontally it is a very slow mount actually it's not that slow at all i thought it was gonna move way slower than that 20 miles per hour is not bad for being one of the first mounts in the game but obviously we're not including uh vertical speed it's got a pretty good vertical speed but there you go there is the slime mount moving on to the next mount and that is honey eyed goggles now this i expect to be very slow horizontally yep 10 miles per hour and obviously it's really fast that way but we ain't measuring that maybe for another day maybe for another day we measure that moving on to the one that i expect to be the slowest uh this one is actually not that bad in water but when it comes to land this turtle the turtle mount goes the same speed as the honey eye goggles which is pretty surprising this is a really fast turtle if we're being honest so next up we have the bunny mount one of my favorite pre-hard mode mounts let's see what it can reach a good 38 miles per hour not bad at all i'm gonna go ahead and drop the oh god why do you Okay, you see how it's not level to me? How come I go through it? Can we Re-logic, can we talk about this and fix this in 1.3.6? I don't like this. Moving on to the hard mode mounts, we are on one of the rarest, in my opinion. I rarely ever get this. I think I've only gotten this mount once. The Basilisk mount. Now, this one I expect to go really fast. 41 miles per hour, and doesn't it dash? No, it doesn't dash. I think it does damage, though. Doesn't this do summoner's damage when you hit something? That's really cool. But yeah, there's that 41 miles per hour. Not bad. Seeming like that one is our fastest, and we're slowly getting faster as it goes. Now, the Unicorn mount. This one, from what I know, is the fastest this horizontal terraria vanilla mount so let's see let's see it gets this little boost right there and we're going 61 miles per an hour that's crazy moving on to the pig ron mount i don't expect this to go that fast it's actually not that bad 40 for it's gonna go faster than 40 46 that's actually not bad at all given that this is a mount you usually fly around but 40 is pretty good we are now on the scutlix mount and other mount that i can never get my hands on but it is a really really cool mount because it attacks things as you can see it killed something 41 miles per hour is not bad for this mount but i wish it was a little bit faster given how hard it is to find so we are on the last four vanilla mounts boom the martian saucer slash ufo 41 miles per hour not bad at all that's the max speed it could reach uh it's a really good mount that's really all i can say it's probably like one of the per most perfect mounts just to have but moving on shrimpy truffle this one i don't expect to move fast at all given that you know it is a flying amount and it does like being on water so uh sadly this is probably the slowest one we've had yet moving on to the reindeer one of my favorite uh holiday mounts event mounts whatever you want to call it it's pretty good uh it could probably reach pretty decent speeds flying and not flying look at this 61 it's matching the uh unicorn but it matches the unicorn speed which is uh pretty pretty damn good pretty damn good moving on to the final vanilla mount and that is the drill containment unit 
and let's just see 31 miles per hour it's okay i mean given that its use is to just break stuff that's not bad at all who the fuck shot that feather at me so we are now moving on to the thorium mounts now thorium has a good bit of mounts some of them are pretty rare and hard to get but let's start with the rocket cart this is the other mine cart i was talking about and let's also obviously put everything else in our inventory boom all right here we go i expect this mount to be insanely quick it's a rocket on a mine cart like come on what did what did the other one reach oh my god this one is flying 128 this is way faster than the mechanical cart as expected good job on this one i like this mount a lot moving on to the next mount we got the crab one of my favorite mounts because i always just get this one in every playthrough it's a useful mount early game so we're in the like 40 41 section not too bad at all we are on the mount which i expect to hold the slowest record next to the shrimpy truffle the anvil used specifically for vertical downward speed let's see how fast we can go it's stuck between zero and one it's so slow that that it's kind of bugging out the counter oh oh i saw a one in there <laughs> boom we are in the hard mode section of the thorium mounts this one really cool looking and probably one of the easiest to get in hard mode because you just gotta fight cosmics which is not too hard of a boss in hard mode but 51 miles per hour is not bad we are now getting into the rarer and harder to find mounts and this is the battle hound i think or blood hound from the blood moon this one i expect to go really fast 51 really only 51 miles per hour it's kind of slow a flying mount goes faster than that but yeah now the desecrated heart another hard mount to find in my opinion i don't think i've ever gotten this maybe just once also goes 51 miles per hour so maybe a bunch of these mounts are just like optional in terms of like if you get one it's the same speed it's just another variant you know what i'm saying but moving on molten collet this one i've gotten once for sure and this was a great mount to have let's see if it goes faster than 51 it does 76 beautiful this thing's fast as hell moving on to one of our water mounts boom the whale great in water not exactly the best on land but at least it hits one consistently unlike the uh, anvil which was cycling between zero and one we now move on to the nimbus mount which i think is a happy days related mount and let's see how fast it goes 41 is not bad at all given that it is a flying mount and it looks really cool i like this mount a lot moving on to the broomstick mount i expect to reach some speeds with this 62 that's not bad 62 miles per hour is a great speed for a broomstick again another flying mount doing really good on horizontal speed moving on to an old one's army mount medium rare steak beautiful this thing i think is another flying mount but it does pretty good speeds on land 41 miles per hour is not bad it also does shoot fireballs when there's enemies nearby so it's pretty good and we are on the final mount the otherworldly something what the hell is it called otherworldly rune and let's just see what speeds this baby can hit i know this one is fast okay 104 miles per hour now how many mounts have have reached 100 i think only the two mine carts and this have reached 100 all right now we're moving on to mods that have a lesser amount of mounts that's kind of that's a weird word lesser amount of mounts but we have calamity here with three mounts the juice mod with two uh elemental unleash with i think one and then louis afk and elements awoken now there is a bunch of other mods that have a bunch of mounts but i think we're gonna save that for a part two because i know two mods alone that have like 18 or 20 combined but yeah let's start with the juiced mod mounts we have the scooter another one of my favorites because i always get it and the airplane a really cool mount that i usually don't get my hands on unless there's a certain reason to but yeah let's go ahead let's put the scooter to the test i'm expecting at least 30 all right yeah i was gonna say 30 but 36 you know is better than 30 six miles per hour faster or six miles faster and let's test out the airplane now now the airplane is very interesting because it goes pretty fast on land but the whole point of it is to take flight it is an airplane let's move on to the two mods that only have one and that is elemental leash and louis afk boom the purity shield is probably one of the coolest mounts in the game in terms of like usefulness is really really useful for fighting bosses and uh, you can also do this it goes 51 you could also hit was it shift is it shift or space it's space you can hit space and you can go slower and you see we're hitting like 26 mile per hour in this let's go ahead let's try out the improved drill mount which is a cloud a nimbus cloud kind of oh my god 153 miles per hour i did not expect this to go that fast at all but it is from louis afk which is pretty much a cheat mod if we think about it so we're gonna do elements awoken's mount 
notes now because there's only two of them and we'll finish off with calamities let's start with pio's present or pio pia's present something right about element drag elemental dragon bunny babe elena's youtuber item boom beautiful got another little cute bunny mount and it goes pretty fast 56 miles per hour nice good job on this mount i like it a lot moving on to the next mount though that is the sacred crystal greed drive is even the strongest minds to madness i don't know why i'm deciding to read all the like tool tips now boom i don't know what the hell this is but let's get on the floor here 51 miles per hour right 51 okay it's not too bad this is seems like another little flying mount it's very very uh flimsy i don't know if that's the right word slippery because look i could just tap it and look i, I just start sliding just start sliding whatever direction I tap it in. But yeah, let's move on to the final three mounts. And that is the three from Calamity. I expect these to be pretty good because I know one of them is really good. And I usually use them in these uh, videos. Boom. It's not this one. It's the other one. But Brimrose is our first mount. This one, nice 62 miles per hour. Not bad at all. Really good for getting around because I'm assuming this is a hard mode item. You can get it probably from the uh, Brimstone Elemental. Moving on to the Fab Soul mount. This is the mount that I use in my creative world. This mount is super super fast in terms of flying and just running but usually you're flying around 94 miles per hour is not bad at all last but not least the suspicious looking jelly bean boom beautiful this thing i don't expect to go too fast 40 41 not too bad but like i said there's some mounts that are you know used for vertical speed and just flying this is definitely one of them oh my god so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video we tested vanilla mount storium calamity elements awoken juice mod elemental unleash and louis afk mounts there's a couple more mods that i want to test out in another video there was just too many and uh, we're gonna test them out in the future in a part two of this i hope you guys enjoyed the video we are on the road to 60k and we just hit 55k today i appreciate you guys i love you guys a lot and i will see y'all in the next video i love you no homo full homo you know whatever you want it to be.